Uh, well, dummy, dummy's real good. This uh, grow timer I got has a button here. You have to on and off. And of course, we have it set up to where it can be pushed against the wall and turn this off. Didn't notice. Wondering why the sky is not clearing out because that's hooked to my frequency generator. And uh, basically, <laughs> so dummy ended up kicking it against the wall somehow and didn't notice it was not running. And I'm like, why is the sky not clearing out? What's <laughs> what's going on with all of that? Basically, got all these fuckers out here. I like see all this shit. Not a, like all my power devices. You can run a device in this day and age without having some frequency or some power to it, and it like at least my area because I've been doing this in this area for four to five years now. As you can see, it's finally subsiding. It's a uh, what about three hours? Well, who knows how long it was off. It could have been overnight. I didn't notice until before we went to uh, Chippewa. Just fractured my foot and jumping off a cliff and a stupid guy. So, but I noticed three hours ago we went to Chippewa to get an x-ray and, oh, the fucking frequency generated off. Dummy kicked the fucking thing against the wall somehow and got it shut off. So I'm not sure what time frame it is, but I know what time frame when I turned it back on. So it was only about three hours ago. All I'm running is a square wave frequency, uh, 783 hertz, you know, the Schumann resonance. And that's the best thing I think. Um, and yeah, just take a look at it. And this is why I think it clears out on this side quicker because my house has aluminum siding on it. Now, these frequencies don't like to uh, travel, this energy doesn't travel well through aluminum. That's why Faraday cages are so good at canceling out EMS. And so that and uh, I believe PVC I read are two things. Uh, that's why I decided to mess around with the PVC pipe and maybe it'll be a better uh, better condor, a better uh, driver. But yeah, this is about three hours of having the Schumann resonance turned on. And it was, I'll show you here in a second what it did look like. It looked basically all just like that. Your basic gray cloud coverage, barely any sun, no vitamin D, no frequencies and upgrading codes coming through that because of their little barrier that they put up. No DNA expansion because of their little barrier they put up. Vitamin D either. That's an interesting thing. The most interesting is when you get down to the fact that the Schumann resonance is basically the scientific side of how Reiki works. Okay? What do you do when you tune into Reiki? You connect to Father Sky and you collect, connect down to Mother Earth. And uh, you imagine both of them swirling inside of your work field and you imagine you being in the center in your heart center and that's basically what happens with the frequencies here from the sun and the earth it's just like a binaural beat everything's a fractal of itself you can see it in different ways when you understand it right so the same way that a binaural beat will go one frequency goes into one ear Another frequency goes into another ear, and your brain makes up the frequency in the difference in pitch. Now, 
I believe that Mother Earth works the same way because she's just a bigger version of us, right? So the sun comes down, it has the frequency. She has her frequency that she sends up. And in the cavity that we walk in, in between the ionosphere and the crust of the planet, Mother Nature, Sophia, then in this cavity we walk in is where, like the brain cavity of Mother Nature, where the frequency is being taken from two different pitches and made into one. And that's the Schumann resonance, 7.83 hertz. Look at the scientific benefits of it. What we're doing, what humans are doing in this planet right now, in an effort to still control other humans, we just have them utilizing this, cutting off from consciousness, so everybody expands and understands, it's more control. But they're cutting off sunlight from getting up. They have the Gwen Towers that cut us off from Mother Nature's frequency. Can't even see it behind the tree. There's a big Gwen Tower up there. But, yeah, so they put out the fake spectrum of frequency on the ground level. They put that shit up there. Keep the sun's frequency from coming down. And it's just an effort to stop DNA upgrade. When you can't control people, you can't continue to control people <laughs> and stay profitable. But it, there's something called karma. And everybody, everybody is doing something wrong to people. It's going to come to an end. All right, I got real deep. <laughs> Just to show three hours running the Schumann resonance. So it was three hours. Oh yeah, what do you got? CIA planes flying around trying to figure out what's going on. Look at the direction of the devices heading. Decide where to spray next. That's how that works. The other thing is the wildlife. The birds, plant life thrives in the vicinity of said devices. The birds go crazy when the frequency generator is on and just thrive more. And they're not out flying right now, but usually I get a get a whole bunch just circling over the chem buster. It's pretty funny. But that's a that's a real world experience right there that can show you that yeah, so if nature's responding to it in a healthy manner, it can grow plants bigger and healthier. And uh, mainstream science shouldn't ignore it, although it's what's systematically being done. All right, three hours. Went too deep, but we're uh, three hours of clearing right there.